To find the oxidation number for each element in CuCl, that's copper 1 chloride, we'll use these rules here. The first thing you'll note is there's no negative or positive charge after the CuCl. That means it's a neutral compound and all of the oxidation numbers, they'll add up to zero. You won't see copper here on our list. Copper is a transition metal, so it can have different oxidation states depending on what it's bonded to. But down here, group 17, sometimes called 7A, those are the halogens. Chlorine is in that group there. It will be minus one, with a few exceptions when it's bonded to oxygen and fluorine. So here, the chlorine will have an oxidation number of minus one. Remember we said this will all add up to zero. The only way that'll happen if the copper is plus one. Plus one minus one, that gives us our zero. You'll note that we have this plus one here. That's why we call this copper one chloride. This is Dr. B with the oxidation number for each element in CUCL. Thanks for watching.